2022 is the third season that Matia Valley baseball coach Steve Colomb has led the varsity program. However, in many ways, it still feels like his first. His inaugural year in 2020 was canceled entirely due to the pandemic, as were all spring sports that year. As a brand new coach, in addition to the uncertainty the rest of the world was going through at that time, Cologne had to break the news to that senior group that their high school careers were over before he even had a chance to coach them in a game. I think eight practices into the season, I remember our last uh, practice that we had as a group with that uh, class of 2020 seniors. A lot of guys are coming up to me because all the rumors that were going around about school being canceled and you know what our season's going to look like. And it was it was definitely difficult to tell a group of guys. I never coached in a game, but we went through so much in you know weight room, open gyms, preseason work to get our get ready for the season. We just we never competed together, so it was really difficult to tell a group of guys. So I never got the opportunity to coach in a game that hey your you know, season your senior year is not going to happen. That was that was definitely difficult and challenging. You know, in my first year. 2021 was much closer to normal, but the season did not start until mid-April, and many of the traditional off-season training and workouts were canceled or limited. Entering year three, Coach Colomb and his team feel that a full year of preparation has the team ready to ride this spring. Yeah, the difference has definitely been all the prep time. The last two years, a lot of cancellations. Couldn't get into a lot of our weight room work, open gyms, even our you know preseason practice time. With all the, even the cancellations this year, we've got a ton of practice in. So the preparation has definitely you know, changed, even though we're performing, just because we've had more time to go through things and prepare the guys. So it's been a huge difference. Another obstacle for the Mustangs last season was a young and inexperienced roster. 2021 was the first high school baseball experience for many of the players on the team, so it's no surprise there were some growing pains along the way. The good news is that most of the roster returns in 2022 with increased experience, confidence, and team chemistry. As the season gets underway, the leadership of Coach Colomb has helped keep the morale high. You know, the first year he came in, uh, it was COVID, so it kind of got cut short. Uh, junior year, it was, like, it was another slow start, kind of COVID still. Uh, we came out of the gate kind of slow, but with Coach, he's kind of just helped us battle back. Uh, this year, we got a lot of young guys, and I think Coach's been able to corral us and keep us uh, in, in line and ready to go. They went through uh, their first year of varsity baseball last year together, so they're a pretty tight-knit group. They've got a lot, they have a lot of fun. They're kind of going through the same learning experiences at the same time. So um, they had some challenges last year. We didn't have the greatest amount of success, um, but from those challenges that we faced last year, I think they understood what they needed to work on in the offseason. We would go to work and have that full you know, offseason like we talked about, and I think it's starting to show up here early in the year. But you know, we still uh, can get better in some areas, but we're, we're definitely improved from where we were at last year. The team did lose all DVC and all area selection Colin Riley to graduation, but seven starters returned to the lineup, including Aiden Wagner, Jeremy Rona, Sean Tracy, and Jake Levine, to name a few. Rona, Cam Hauser, Ryan Ferenkopf, and Connor Axtelowicz headlined the returning pitching staff. I think we got a tight knit group of guys. They're a lot of fun to be around. I enjoy coaching. I'm really lucky to, uh, you know, be in the dugout with them. We don't have any guys who, uh, you know, bring our team down. A lot of positive guys who just like having fun and, and playing ball together. Now that the season is a few weeks in, the Mustang players and coaches are excited to see this group compete for the top of the DuPage Valley Conference. Uh, we just want to compete in the DVC, compete in our conference, and eventually uh, win a regional, win a sectional, keep moving on in the state tournament. For Naperville Sports Weekly, I'm Justin Cornwell.